welcome back to another episode of the Four Horsemen. Almost at the end of the year. Today we're going to be working with this Two Jet C. I think that's what it's called. Yes, Two Jet C. And the theme is going to be Mars Crawler. So we got to make something that looks that uh, we drive around in the planet Mars. That shouldn't be that difficult. For next month, the last episode is this Ford Grand Torino, not to be confused with the Torino Talladega. They're not the same. And the theme is Mad Max. That's going to be fun. So remember, if you want to feature, send the pictures to that email down below. For this, we're going to open it. I bought this one for the wheels. Running out of uh, off road wheels, so I had to buy these. So let me get this open and I'll be back. All right, it's been a few days. Hopefully, hopefully you're keeping up with the with the videos. I posted a short drilling this out and the donor car for the wheels. So it's time to do a makeover here. And by the way, this 2 Jet C it has a metal base, in case you were wondering. Got myself a, a pry bar here. The wheels fit perfectly, I didn't have to do new axles or anything. have my long 256 screws here which I use to hold the casting you probably seen this before So I'm going to take this up. I want to keep it. I'm going to get the tape and I'll be back. All right. So first I'm going to try to knock out some of that uh, gloss. Never seen any movie where an outer space vehicle is glossy. I forgot I didn't have the uh, microphone or the additional microphone installed so that's why you're probably noticing a different sound here Oops. and there it goes this is Tamiya tape I don't need this to be perfect this vehicle to look uh, somewhat banged up and I'm back check it out this is Vallejo Goblin Green you know these uh, spray cans are not cheap but they do an awesome job. It's been like two minutes, maybe less, and it already looks dry. So I'm gonna remove that uh, perfect tape job that I did.
Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Um, I'm gonna wait until it dries a little more and then I'm gonna do some light sanding that way I can try to expose the rivets. I'll be back. Okay, let me see if this works. I think I got the 3600. There it is. The only thing I'm missing is some dust for the tires and the wheels, but I don't have any of those uh, kits. I mean, I could use paint, but I'd rather use the little dusty dust. All right, let's take some pictures and I'll be seeing you on the next one.